Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Today we have a very special artist, and my name is RJ. Yes, sir. What's up? A good, a good friend. It's great to have you on here. Uh, we you know each other for like what, like over a year, like yeah. a year and a half or something. Like, that. like it's crazy. Well, I'm from California, like Southern California. Um, half Indian, half Filipino. Yeah, I started. I started making music when I was like 11. Uh, I didn't start with rap. I was starting with like singing and stuff, even though I completely suck at singing. So what made you want to start singing at 11 years old? Um, I don't know. I was into, I was just like, I loved music. And my mom and my dad like always made me play a bunch of instruments like, uh, like violin and all that good stuff. And then mm -hmm. I just thought, I didn't think it was cool. It's just, it kind of came to me, you know? And then I just started writing and stuff like that. And then um, I didn't really like choose beats or anything. It was just writing. And so, yeah, that was basically it. Who, who are your favorite artists right now? My favorite artist right now? Shoot. Yeah. That's a hard question. Um, I just went to a Chelsea Cutler concert and I actually met her, which is actually kind of funny. Uh, quick story. I forgot to buy the actual ticket to her concert. I only had the VIP ticket, but they still let me in. Uh, she still let me in to go see her, so that was crazy. And then, um, so Chelsea Color, Jeremy Zucker, uh, Rose Boy, definitely love Rose Boy. And then, um, Sabler Prolific, Palfu. Well, the weather's always like fluctuating here. It's either really hot or just gets like crazy cold. Um, what else? I mean, growing up here was, it was pretty nice actually, you know, a lot of nice people, but sometimes like a lot of people in California just, they're fake basically is what I'll say is, is yeah, they're fake. So you got to pick and choose who you trust carefully. That's what mm -hmm. I've learned by like living here. Uh, what's happening, uh, let's just say a month yeah, from now, two months from now, um i'm dropping my ep soon next week so sorry if you get your scratching it's because the cats are like i'm yeah. in my bathroom right now yeah but yeah. um i'm dropping my ep next week um worked on it for a couple months now even though it's only like four songs but dropping that um hopefully hope i'm hoping it'll do pretty well i'm pretty sure it'll do pretty well because there's like some of the best songs i've ever made and uh, yeah, and then um, getting a feature from someone, I can't say who yet, even though you know, but mm -hmm. you know. I mean, I'll be graduating high school soon, so I'll have more time to focus on music as well. Yeah, uh, I've been doing so much homework, honestly, just to like get myself, because I'm not studious at all. So I just need to catch up and graduate, get the hell out, you know? So do you want to give a little story of how we met i remember it was um it was be alone it was be alone and then you were in the comments or something and then i saw you and then everyone in the comments was going crazy and then um yeah yeah, yeah i remember that now then we got put in a group chat yeah and then we got put in the group chat brad put us in the group chat yeah and then we started working from there yeah. i was gonna say i'm glad that you know we've come more further because we've improved like a lot like producing wise and a lot like uh lyric wise and just like music wise in general you know are you going into any uh, music festivals or anything like that um not really no but my friend you know Cavasol, right yeah 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 Cavasol. he said he wanted to come to la and do a couple shows maybe open for some people and then i was like let me hop on that wave you know <laughs> yeah yeah sure. yeah that's crazy mm -hmm. so you're not doing any shows or anything like that anytime soon uh no i gotta i'm trying to build my audience first and then i'll do shows because um yeah yeah i want to build my audience first i was gonna like throw not like a party but maybe like yeah kind of like a party in my own house because i have like a very big backyard so i was thinking of just inviting a bunch of people from my school especially since they don't really know me since i'm new and then I was just gonna like, you know, play a bunch of sad songs and vibe all together, you know?
That's just I how only people. performed like once in front of like 300 people. Really? Yeah, it was um it was at my sister's 18th birthday party. Ooh, okay. Yeah. And I performed a G Easy song. <laughs> um it was called A Very Strange Time. Okay. Uh, you should listen to that song. It's actually really good. How cold or hot does it get over there? Um, in the winter, it gets like a couple years ago, it got down to like the negative 40. And then oh my like, god, I could never <laughs> live in that. <laughs> and um in the summertime, it can get like 95, 100. Uh, 95 is not that bad over there. It gets, like you, 100, it gets like 105, 106 over here. So. That's crazy. Yeah, like it gets pretty hot, but, um, but yeah, nothing like 120 or something like in the yeah, desert. One, no, one time it was 114 and the AC in my car was broken. So I poured Gatorade all over myself. What? I went to the gas station, just poured Gatorade on myself. But wasn't that like sticky? <laughs> yeah, it had, it was, but I, it was the only thing. It was all cold and everything, you know. Oh my god, that's kind of crazy. Funny. Yeah. That's a funny but story. I could never live in negative forty though. Never. But, um, is there anything else you wanted to kind of touch on while we're here? Um, go listen to my EP when it comes out, and please pre-save it because I want to get on editorials. <laughs> we'll listen to his EP, and um peep his music video because that's yeah. coming too right music video coming out soon yeah for sure i forgot to talk right. about that so i'm yeah. talking about speaking of music videos i dropped today yes yes my video today go it's check fire. that out i appreciate you coming on here yeah. and just you know participating in this great interview yeah thank you man